up guys and girls it's ryan here in new limit uh you've seen me do installs you've seen me do uh mechanical work here at no limit but today we're going to be talking tires one of our bread and butter tires the falcon at3w uh it's one of our favorite customer favorites i run these on my subaru run them on my wife's forerunner uh, my co-worker tony he runs them on his forerunner my coworker Kevin runs them on his wife's forerunner. So super popular here. Uh, if you have any wet or snow um, driving and you come to us and say that, we're gonna recommend this tire straight off the bat. Not a mud tire, not a hybrid ter terrain tire, the AT3W. Um, the AT3W is getting discontinued and that is going to the AT4W. Why would you change the tire? What's the difference? We're gonna go over that. So looking at the AT3 tire, uh, big thing about it is three peak snow rated tire. So that's a, a huge plus. Um, the second thing is that it's 55 mile tread uh, warranty on it. 55,000 mile tread warranty, which is great. That's gonna get you four or five years driving every day. This is something that you can put on your daily driver. The big upgrade to the AT4W is 65,000 mile tread warranty. So that is basically, they're predicting this tire will last you 60 to 65,000 miles if you rotate and air them up correctly. And I mean, 10,000 miles, I'll take that all day for the same price. So the big difference to the AT4W is, let's show you here, the sidewall. Much more aggressive lettering, uh, change in design around the bead area to eject water, debris, things like that. Also, they've uh, kicked it up a notch on the ejectors for rocks, water, all those things. That's something that the AT3 was lacking. Not just in design, they have also reinforced these sidewalls in, in material. It is called now a Duraspec sidewall on the load range E and F models, and it has basically improved air down, so you have to get that strength to go to 10, 15 PSI if you're off-roading, and also while towing. If you want to crank it up to 80 PSI and put a, a trailer behind you, this tire is going to be able to handle both of those scenarios. Lastly, the last thing we want to talk about on these tires is the weight. The weight is a big deal for people that don't want to increase their rolling mass too much, lose too many miles per gallon, things like that. Um, now there has been a little bit of a weight gain on the AT4W and that is due to the sidewall strength. Um, to me, I'll gain two, three pounds and uh, be a little bit stronger. But uh, that's just my opinion. Uh, it's definitely worth the weight in gold and it's a great tire to go with and we're gonna that's gonna be our new recommended tire for the snow, the mud, all those type of things. So hit us up if you need a set and I'll see you next time.